We all want to spend less time traveling and more time living. In 2021, it is highly likely that you will see or ride in a flying car. Those who follow Consumer Electronics Show know very well that the flying car phenomenon is soon taking to the skies. Maybe you're ready to get behind a flying wheel. If you have a Tesla or a Cadillac ATS, it's time to upgrade into a flying car. Let's hop right into the top 20 flying cars in the world. Pal V Liberty with Dutch engineering and Italian design, this is one of the best products from Europe. The personal air land vehicle, designed to seat two people, has a maximum takeoff weight of 910 kilograms and can fly at 160 kilometers per hour. The 100 horsepower supercar can cover a maximum range of 500 kilometers, with the fuel lasting for 4.3 hours at maximum capacity. While the idea first struck the makers in 1999, 2017 marked the public launch of PAL V Liberty, and the keys would be handed over to the first customers in 2020. Terrafugia Transition With the help of a button, you can convert a car into a flying plane with the blessing of science. Yes, that's the Terrafugia Transition for you. While on the ground, it is a futuristic car. It then spreads out and takes off like a helicopter. When in the sky, it behaves like a plane. One science news fact about this car is, it doesn't come with the problem of hangar storage, ground transportation, or aviation fuel for that matter. The Terrafugia conducted the first flight test recorded for cars that fly in 2006. It is planned to have a flight range of 787 kilometers using either automotive premium grade unleaded gasoline or 100 LL AV gas, and a cruising flight speed of 172 kilometers per hour. Aeromobile 4.0 With this flying car, you can experience the sky up close and personal thanks to its excellent durability and stability. Special attention has been paid to keeping this lightweight, but not at the expense of style and comfort. Inspired by the mythical winged horse Pegasus, the Aeromobile 4.0 comes with an advanced automotive crash structure design and occupant restraint system for the two passengers. The vehicle can fly at a top speed of 360 km per hour, while the top speed on the road is 160 km per hour. The maximum takeoff weight of the vehicle is 960 kg, while the usable load on the fuel capacity are 240 kg and 901 respectively. Users can travel distances up to 1,000 kilometers on this flying automobile. Opener Blackfly This car was slated to hit the market in 2019, but the best bet is that it's going to come out at a price of an SUV. Unlike some of the models mentioned above, the Opener Blackfly does not behave exactly like a car on the ground. It has to be carried by a pair of carts while on the roads. Also, it has the capacity to seat only one person averaging 6.5 feet in height and weighing 250 pounds. Not quite the flying car treat, but it is affordable and conceivable. This flying car has a cruise speed of 130 kilometers per hour, can fly to a range of 64 kilometers, and climb up to 1,000 feet. Molar Sky Car. This flying car has been around for the longest among the ones on this list, having been put together sometime around the early 2000s. However, this car is not fly legal, meaning that in its present form, it is not FAA certified. And while Moeller spent $150 million in developing this car, it is now available on eBay for $5 million. Not a high price for curiosity, if you're a hardcore car and technology enthusiast. Paul Moeller designed it with a range of 1,448 kilometers, a cruising speed of 491 kilometers per hour and a weight of 1,088 kilograms. Car Plane this is one of the few flying cars to be awarded a government subsidy. This happened in 2016 when the German government granted it half a million euros in funding. In May of 2017, it became one of the few automobiles to receive a reserve funding from the Federal Economics Ministry. What sets the car plane apart from the others is that it is a convergence product, meaning that it is designed to handle all kinds of usage, private and commercial. Its maximum speed is 222 kilometers per hour with a cruise speed of 200 kilometers per hour. It can fly across across a range of 833 kilometers and climb up to 15,000 feet at 1,500 feet per minute. E-Hang 184 with a maximum flight speed of 100 kilometers per hour, you can cruise above the sea level for the duration of 25 minutes. The coolest feature of this flying car is that it comes with a downward facing camera that is also aided by flashlights and signal lights. The storage space for this one seater can take a 120 inch backpack with a rated payload of 100 kilograms. The drone is designed for daily use and built using entirely new technology. 
Let's pick up speed and technology in the top 10 flying vehicles. Joby Aviation's Air Taxi. Joby Aviation has been working on a personal aerial craft for several years before receiving an enormous cash injection from Toyota and Intel. The conditions of the investment were to provide a practical, all-electric air taxi. This air taxi is interesting compared to others on the list, as it is being designed with the seating capacity of up to five. It will be, by virtue, a lot bigger and heavier than its rivals. The flying car has a 150-plus mile range and flies at 200 miles per hour. DeLorean DR7 the company behind one of the most famous cars in the film industry is developing a flying car. DeLorean Aerospace is headed by Paul DeLorean, who is a nephew to John DeLorean. John was the man principally responsible for the iconic DeLorean gullwing car that became famous in the film Back to the Future as Dr. Brown's time travel device. The DR7 will have a cruising speed of 241 kilometers per hour with a top speed of 389 kilometers per hour. At full speed, the range will be 193 kilometers. The DR7 will carry two passengers in a tandem configuration. It will be six meters long with a wingspan of 5.6 meters. Uber Air VTOL Taxi. That's right, Uber will fly you. However, this innovation was acquired by a familiar name, Joby Aviation. Specifications for Uber's VTOL aircraft include 145 miles per hour cruise speed, 60 mile range, and three hour sprint of 25 mile trips, and capacity for one pilot and four riders. Airbus Vahana. To outshine the apparent gold rush of flying cars, Airbus has been developing one of their own. Their main idea is to save money on hiring trained and experienced pilots to fly the thing once released. Since autopilot software is pretty mature at this point, it shouldn't be out of the scope of possibility to do this, especially for an accomplished organization with the size of Airbus. Progress appears to be going smoothly with the first successful test flight done earlier this year. It has a cruise speed of 200 kilometers per hour, a flight range of 50 kilometers, and can take off at a maximum weight of 815 kilograms. Lilium Jet A German startup called Lilium Aviation is also getting in on the flying car project game. Their proposal is, like others, quite ambitious and is planned to carry up to five passengers. They also plan to make it possible for their flying car to be hailed using an app on a smartphone. Like all other companies on the list, Lilium hopes that theirs will change public transportation forever. Lilium's solution will be an all-electric VTOL flying car, but with a twist, it will be jet-powered. Kitty Hawk Cora. The Cora Flying Car Project from Kitty Hawk Corporation recently got a huge boost. Google co-founder Larry Page threw in his financial muscle. The Cora Flying Car targets to directly provide easier transport while offering competition to its potential rivals like Airbus and Uber. The craft features no less than 12 lift fans to provide the flying car with vertical takeoff and landing capabilities. Cruising speed, 110 miles per hour. Its flight range is 62 miles, flight time 19 minutes with a 10 minute reserve. The payload is 400 pounds on 100% electric power. Toyota SkyDrive The Toyota SkyDrive is currently the smallest electric vehicle in the world and measures a modest 2.9 meters long, 1.1 meters tall, and 1.9 meters wide. It is being developed by a group of specialist Toyota engineers led by Tusabu Nakamura, who actually designed the vehicle in his spare time. It is planned to have a cruising speed of 40 to 50 kilometers per hour, maximum flight time of 5 to 10 minutes, altitude of 150 meters, and weigh 400 kilograms. Astro Passenger Drone Astro Aerospace's passenger drone is yet another flying car currently in development. Its working prototype features a carbon fiber shell, 16 independent roller blades, and a touch control system in the cockpit. Its empty weight, including batteries, is 240 kilograms, maximum speed of 70 kilometers per hour, and a flight time of 20 to 25 minutes. Moog Surefly the Surefly is a robust VTOL aimed at commercial operations and consumers looking for a durable, self-controlled flying experience, especially those who don't mind paying around $200,000 per unit. It was developed by Workhorse, but the company sold its aviation division to Moog for $4 million in November 2019. The initial version will carry around 400 pounds of cargo, although a more heavy-duty version capable of carrying up to 650 pounds is currently in development. 
Both have captured the American military's attention. Its pride includes maximum flight distance of 70 miles, 70 miles per hour top speed, one hour of flight time available per tank of gasoline, flight ceiling of 4,000 feet, and a curb weight of 1,100 pounds. Lift Hexa. Hexa is an all-electric single-passenger air taxi aimed primarily at tourism and short-distance air travel. With a total empty weight of 432 pounds, Hexa can carry a 250-pound passenger for up to 15 minutes of flight time. Lyft Aircraft is one of 15 companies which are members of Agility Prime, the United States Air Force initiative, to accelerate the commercial market for advanced air mobility vehicles. Undoubtedly, this is another amazing flying car in the world currently in use. Aero Mobile 3.0. But first, do us a favor. Click that like button to inspire us. Subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell and you won't miss any interesting videos. Done then, let's go. As if making a flying car is not feet enough, they made this one collapsible. The Aero Mobile 3.0 is not only fit for air strips, grassy or paved, short or long, but also perfectly fit for the road. So you can drive it on regular gasoline and fit it into any standard parking space. Its sleek design and its easy operability have made it one of the eagerly watched flying cars. This model boasts a cruising airspeed of 260 kilometers per hour over a maximum distance of 750 kilometers. Its price varies from 1.2 million to 1.6 million, depending on specifications. Samson Switchblade. Flying at the rate of 200 miles per hour and capable of rising up to 13,000 feet, this car becomes flight ready in just under three minutes. In addition to seating two people, it can accommodate 100 pounds of luggage. The flying car features a wide cabin and has the power to weight ratio of a 2017 Corvette. This hovering automobile also comes with heating and air conditioning facilities to make all weather conditions enjoyable. For driving, it has a 5-speed transmission and its wings and tails are extendable, yet perfectly protected while you're on the road. VRCO Neo XCraft British company VRCO is currently working on its own flying car. They have designed their Neo X craft to transverse land, air, and water. According to the company's CEO, Daniel Hayes, the Neo X craft should be ready, at least for road testing only. Its design is particularly innovative. Its ducted fans can be used in flight or rotated to become wheels. The flying car's VTOL mode will enable it to carry around 180 kilograms in payload, equivalent to about two passengers. Other specifications include cruise speeds of 160 knots, 60 minutes flight endurance, and electric powered engine. Which one is the most amazing flying car? Do you want to ride any of them? Share your thoughts in the comment section. Like always, if you enjoyed it, be sure to give us a big thumbs up and leave us some love in the comment section. To keep up to date with all of our awesome videos, be sure to hit subscribe and turn your notifications on to never miss a thing. Until next time, do take care of yourself.